here today And all I hear is how I'm chasing crazy dreams They'll see Cause I've got perfect songs and melodies Just waiting to come out of me And you'll sing along Like oh, whoa Fancy words, clever lines and tales That take you back in time And you'll sing along Like oh, They should have believed in me. Should have believed, baby. And welcome to the spiel. Am I dripping? Look, you, you're dripping. I'm dripping. I'm dripping with sweat behind my neck. <laughs> this is a really heavy headpiece. And if you're wondering what we're doing, yes. you've got to stick around. You've got to stick around. There's a lot. There's a lot coming up, and you've got to stick around. Like, now I've you see me. I've never seen you now use you your don't. hands that much. I just, I just feel a need to <laughs> explain to people. Why? You know, and then you feel like you got to go, da 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 Okay, like, this, is a, this is a family you show, You said it's a right? family show. But I don't really want to take it off. It looks It so looks good. great. It's like, this is like corresponding on the color wheel or something, opposite, so it's it's gorgeous. You think I would get looks if I went into Kroger and got my groceries? <laughs> What's great is they'll see you the next aisle over, so they'll know you're coming. <laughs> they'll get out of your way. They'll look up there and read, like, oh, darn, the bread's over there. Oh, there goes the feather girl. This is fantastic. I, 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 I don't know. The problem is if we keep all of this on, will people really pay attention to what we're saying? Oh, I look, think so. Look, look, watch this. Watch. They will can't. People they can't. pay attention. Will they really pay attention to what we're saying? Okay, so here, anyway, we come in this morning. Whoa, wait, it's got me. This is what is sitting on the set of the kitchen. Do you know what this is? Sure. sure. It's, an, <laughs> it's an alligator mouth. Yes. Um, Guess who left is this? It's, who? Jason Pinkston. You know why? Why? Where would you find gators? Florida. Florida. That's where Jason is today. He's in Florida. This so he is his way of you. rubbing it in. Wow. I mean, I hope that he doesn't encounter many of these. You think this is a real one? Like in real bone? Uh, I don't know. Oh, it looks like it on the bottom. It is. It's a little frightening. And it's been, have we done a peekaboo in, uh, uh, will we do that today on, on the set? Will we let people can find the Where's Waldo? Look for the, is it a crocodile? Is it an alligator? See, it's, it, the, it's the, by the teeth somehow. Well, it's my teeth. I think it's the snout. It's like pointy around. No, it's mm. teeth. So one of them will see you in a while. The other one will see you after a while, oh, crocodile, crocodile see you later, alligator. You're so good. You're so good. Uh, hey, I got a question for you. Okay. Okay. With vacations, scientifically, it has been proven. This is proven. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you enjoy your vacation more when you're planning, say, weeks, weeks out, maybe even months out, mm -hmm. as you're planning? I already have the answer. Do you enjoy your vacation when you're actually on vacation. That was good. Thank you. You won't take this off I usually off use my teeth, playing. you know, I better, yeah. Um, or do you enjoy your vacation most when you've returned home and you're well rested? Oh, I thought you were going to a different direction. I thought you were saying, <laughs> I thought you were saying, um, <laughs> before, during, after. When do you enjoy your vacation most? It's a scientific, it's proven. During. Eh. Would you like to try again? Home. Nope. Getting ready? As you're planning. Here's okay. why. In our minds, Florida, for instance, you've created this scenario, right? Mm -hmm. You're on the sandy white beaches. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. You know, the weather is just perfect. Mm -hmm. The drive down there, the flight down was just great. There mm -hmm. were no problems. You're on the beach. You're enjoying this little frou-frou drink with the umbrellas and all. You know what I mean? And like, you've got this great view. Like you walk out, you know, yeah. and the, it, the breeze and everything's perfect. Yeah. And what happens when you get there? First of all, there's probably going to be a traffic jam there, or sure. you're delayed in the airport. Okay. They haven't got your room ready. They don't have your room. And the room, by the way, overlooking the parking lot. There was a storm be more the week before, and storm. it's put a bunch of seaweed right. on the sand. Right, a bunch of seaweed sand. there. The undertow's bad. It's a red flag. Yeah. You can't get hit. The drink, now they're going to give you like this plastic thing with a Slurpee straw in it. Yeah. It's not even going to be. I mean, no. what's the point? Don't even bother going. Here's what I thought you were going <laughs> to ask me. What would you rather do? Yes. Plan, plan, plan for a couple of weeks, a vacation, or... Just get in your car and just go, go. and wear this, just wear all of this stuff when you go. And wear this stuff. And this and is going to make for a good time. And have an alligator on your shoulder like this. That's how you do it. That'd be fun. That's how you roll. Mm -hmm. Spontaneity. 
Well, this is how we roll. Mm -hmm. We've got a great show coming great up. Great show. Yes. Great show. Yes. Stick around. We'll be right back. Coming up on the spiel. I happened to go to a burlesque vaudeville show okay. and I was just overwhelmed. I thought this looks familiar. I don't know why. And I approached the producer and talked my way into his next show. These are not just cakes. These are works of art. I mean, do people really even want to cut these after you prepare them? When, when we show people our cakes, they sometimes they are shocked at how good they actually look. The Bank of Heron has been serving Southern Illinois since 1937, offering everything from checking and savings accounts to loans and a full service trust department. With convenient locations and a dedicated professional staff, our outreach and involvement in the communities we serve plays an integral role in how we do business, proving it's not just a bank, it's a relationship. The Bank of Heron. To find out more, visit bankofheron.com. My name's Chris Boyd. I'm the owner of the Goddard Place in Anna, Illinois. It's uh, about a 600 square foot log cabin that we rent out as a vacation rental. We like to sit down and meet people and talk to them about our experiences in the area. We have approximately about eight to 10 wineries within 30 minutes of the cabin. The Shawnee National Forest, the beauty and the hiking, the inspiration point. It'll take a drive up to the cross. It's really nice to see at sunrise or sunset. When local hospitality and endless adventure wait just outside your door, that's how you'll know you're in Shawnee Forest Country. My name is Terry Roger Smith. I am a PA. And I'll be practicing in Christopher. Well, I'm family practice, meaning I treat everything from three months old to the end. Um, I think the biggest thing with me that you'll find is I'm a patient advocate and I'm very much for the patient making their decisions because ultimately it's their body. Visit any one of our 11 locations in Southern Illinois. Log on to our website, crhpc.org. Here's a quick recipe for a great party dip featuring Prairie Farm Chef's Blender Roasted Red Pepper Dip. Start with your favorite party dish, layer on some refried beans, Prairie Farm Chef's Blender Roasted Red Pepper Dip. Some shredded lettuce. Have fun sprinkling on some cheese. Then grab your favorite crudite or bag of chips and dip away. Check out our website at prairiefarms.com. Crudite. I wonder if they know what that means. Drop. <gasps> what about that for an Lana. intro? Look at that. <laughs> Amazing. Hey. Wow. Thank you very well, much. Well, I, I, you know, I, you've kind of earned your, your name. Is, is, is this your real name? No. Okay. No. <laughs> so give us your stage name. Stage name is Charlotte Sometimes. 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 So we're not going to talk about who you are outside of Charlotte Sometimes, or we will? Oh, I'm okay with that. Okay. Okay. No, I'm fine with that because I'm proud of where I have come with this character and, and all Absolutely. that I'm doing. Absolutely. You know what? You're stunning. And when you mm -hmm. walk into a room, you oh. get attention. And I think it all started, um, you go through what a lot of ladies go through. You know, you're at home and you're questioning, am I doing what's right? You know, I right. want to do certain things in my life. How did we get to this point? To this point, it was a 10-year battle with infertility and adoption issues. Oh, okay and it really took its toll on my body and my mental health. And then when I finally had the babies, I was home with them, but every mom needs a mom's night out. Yes. yes. And I went, I happened to go to a burlesque vaudeville show okay. and I was just overwhelmed. I thought this looks familiar. I don't know why. And I approached the producer and talked my way into his next show. I had no experience, awesome. no idea what I was doing. I, I, I was guided by something. 
Uh -huh. And I debuted, and then suddenly I'm in a burlesque troupe, and then suddenly I'm headlining a show, and now I'm a producer, and it's been seven years, and I am not going to stop anytime soon. And how many shows right. a month? 26 shows a month, Crazy. which is a lot to keep up with, but I don't, I mean, this is it for me. I'm living this fantasy life by day, stay-at-home mom. Do people and stare at all in the grocery store when you're going? I mean, <laughs> you, know? you wouldn't recognize me. Out of this, I don't want to be seen. Okay. I wish, you know, out of this, I, I'm quiet and invisible, but this gives me a chance to be seen and get, uh, maybe just get that attention That's a little awesome. bit. <laughs> what I was going to say is how cool, and this is a cruel world we're living in. Yes, it is. It's hard, and, and how cool would it be to just be another person for a while? Oh, I want to be another person I for want a to while. just wear some of it. I don't even have to wear all of it. Just some of it. It's amazing. It is. It, it's, you feel so beautiful, but I think what's so great is to preach a message of positivity sure. and you know I MC a lot of these shows I don't dance as much anymore I leave that up to the young girls I still do a little bit just to prove again that I feel that sexiness is defined by your confidence oh. and who you are how you walk in the world Indeed. and I try to walk positively and let women and men everybody know you're everybody's beautiful everyone yes. has something about them that's special Stop looking in the mirror and saying, oh, and this and that. And then look in the mirror and say, you know, That's hey, right. this is pretty nice here. That's right. Yeah. I'm, I'm a good, good person here. So right. it's more than just a show. I think there's also a lesson and a message. So did your mother make your headpiece? Oh, oh this is a story in itself. My mother, Marge in Charge, is about Marge to be 85. Wow. And she doesn't see as well anymore, so she adds lots of bling. Not this one. Actually, she bought this for me. Uh, it was her gift for my 46th birthday. Aww. But no, together, this is how we bond. We sit in her home, and we add rhinestones to things, Perfect. and we talk. And, and be jeweled. And, and yeah. be jeweled, absolutely. Mm -hmm. And just have a good time How together. many headpieces do you have? Oh goodness, at this point about 30, uh, 50 wigs, gowns. I mean, it's, it's expensive, don't get me wrong, because right. at my level you have to provide everything yourselves uh -huh. and you don't make a lot of money, you do it because you love it. Sure. I was going to ask you, how, can, how's the money? You, the money means that um, during the week I hustle doing a lot of different jobs <laughs> so I can afford this. So you can do what you want to do. <laughs> right, this yeah. does not pay the mortgage whatsoever. You, when you go to a show like this, a burlesque show or mm -hmm. um, cabaret, cabaret, cabaret sure. yeah, and you see the tip jar, does everybody on the show get to split that? Well, it depends. Uh, one of the shows I do know because they don't allow it. But in other shows, we keep our own tips. Oh, so, nice. you know, the biggest tip that I ever got was $1,100. <gasps> And that from was one person. from one person. And it was, I love your shows. I love your message. I had a great year. Here's something for you and your children. I follow your story online. No strings oh, attached. That's awesome. There you go. So awesome. you never know. Even if it's a young person, they hand you a dollar. It means so much because they're saying, I love what you did I, out yes, there. Correct. Because yes. mm -hmm. they didn't have to. No, yeah. they didn't have to. And a lot of young people come to my shows and a lot of young people are in my shows. So I get to be a mom to the performers awesome. and then a mom to my kids at home. So I'm always in mom mode and but I love taking care of people great so it just it works I didn't know that this would be my life you had a lot of energy when yeah. you walked in the room <laughs> earlier you 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 had the room she I mean, kind of floated yours. she just sort of floated <laughs> in. You know, she was, yes, you know. oh you know in my everyday life it's not that way I tend to be more withdrawn socially anxious and shy which is why I love Charlotte because I get to be the person I, I wish I could 24 7 and on stage I am her I'm very much in control but the rest of my life, you know, with, with children, especially sure. three girls all entering puberty at the same Whoa. time, oh, there's no control at home no. anymore. No, it's no. tough. They don't fall in line. Like you talked about being a choreographer. They don't fall in line at home. They no. do, everybody's dancing to their own drum, yeah. right? And they are not <laughs> impressed by this. They have grown up with this. I was going to ask you how they feel about that. Do they go to school and go, hey, you ought to see my mom? No, my mom is embarrassing. Uh, sometimes Aww. I'll get recognized like at a craft store and there'll be someone from the shows wanting to hug me and my kids just roll their eyes and go oh gosh not again mom no we this, someone wants to say that's hello to good. me that's we have that's to really do that good. and 
Yeah, they just, their friends now are turning 18 and can start going to some of these shows. And they're okay. liking it, aren't they? And they do, and then my daughter wants to hide under her desk at school going, <laughs> no, that's not my mother. But otherwise, no, they're, they're proud. Underneath it all, Good. they're proud. Good. Good. People are going to want to follow you. Okay. Um, they're going to want to know more about your story. What's the best way to find you and track what you're doing? I am on every social network. My kids okay. taught me how to do even Snapchat, which can get very confusing. But my website is charlottesometimes.com, but that's okay. S-U-M because sums are numbers and I get paid to be her. There you go. Sometimes. That's <laughs> and there's a blog and I really let people in behind the scenes of what this is like, especially at my age. And you know, that's not easy. P bits and parts don't want to move the way they used to, but you just have to mind over matter and keep going. Good deal. I say do it as long as you can, except yes. for when you get a little older, the shoes might Oh, oh, be careful. They're beautiful, I, but be careful. Can I confession? Yes. As I get older, the heels are getting shorter and yes. shorter. <laughs> and I'm now in jazz shoes on stage yes. or sometimes flats uh, because, right, we do two shows in a row. So that's about six plus hours of this. Standing. It, oh, it's hard. Yeah, it is. The it. next morning I wake up and go, oh, why didn't I do this at 21? But it's kind of special that I get to do it now. So Absolutely. I'll take it. A crowd pleaser. Thank you Thank so you. much. It Thanks was a for pleasure me. meeting you. Yes, yes. This is what it's all about. We'll be right back. Coming up on The Spiel. I started getting into cakes whenever I was only 16. Oh. I was still in high school. I was watching all the popular shows like The Cake Boss, mm -hmm. um, you know, Gigi's Cupcakes, all that. I was into it. And so I just started icing cakes at home. I had tried dentures and they were not successful. For people that have lost their teeth and are frustrated with wearing dentures, we have new methods and techniques to give people basically a third set of teeth. When you have an extraction or an implant put in, your first thought is, that's going to hurt. I was completely comfortable through this. Dr. Hughes and his staff, they are wonderful. That's a life-changing event for many, many people. And it's something that we do here on a daily basis at Hughes Dental Arts Center. My dad came here in the early 50s and started. My name is John Smith. My brother Terry and I have Smith Dairy Farm. And we're producers of milk for Prairie Farms Dairy. And we're outside at 4.30 in the morning. Cows need fed 365 days a year and you learn the mannerisms of each animal. You learn who they are. Prairie Farms, they depend on us to be finished milking at a time when the truck's going to come to get the milk. We're all one big team. Proudly farmer owned. It's part of what we've been raised to do. Prairie Farms. Silkworm has a dedication to quality. It's kind of unparalleled. Logo design, t-shirts, promotional products. We always strive to keep everything as consistent as possible and make sure that they're getting the same quality across everything they get. Our customer service is top notch. Customers are smiling. You'll get an email that says, hey, that was a great job. We're doing what we're passionate about. We can provide what you're looking for. Come in, check out our website, sit down, talk with one of the sales reps, and discover the Silkworm way. Silkworm, we make great first impressions last. I would encourage all of you to pay it forward and let that random act of kindness define us as a nation. You'll know you're in Shawnee forest country when the hills rise up to meet you. When the fruit of the land seems to be waiting for you to pick it. Where at the end of every path, you'll find another reason to raise a toast. The Shawnee National Forest is home to miles of unbelievable natural wonders. Adventure, wineries, <laughs> and unique places to stay. That's how you'll know you're in Shawnee Forest Country. Plan your getaway at southernmostillinois.com. To find out more about the Spiel or even watch past episodes, visit spielon.com. And we are spieling it in our Southside Lumber Kitchen, brought to you by none other than Prairie Farms, the leader in dairy. How about that? Yes, and today I'm always excited when we go to the kitchen because today we've got cookies and cakes and cupcakes by Allie. 
That's awesome. And then it's cakes actually, by Allie. Actually, it's just called Cakes by Allie. It is Cakes by Allie. But you do so much more. You know, here's the deal. You, you've seen that TV show, Cake Boss. Yeah. She's like the Cake Boss lady. She is. Do you know her? I mean, have you heard? <laughs> heard. I've tasted. Oh, I've enjoyed. She's, I've indulged. She's something. Yeah. I mean, the latest greatest. Is that what you're always trying to do? Yes, that is what we are always trying to do at Cakes by Alley. Um, so we have just um, opened up in our new location in Heron. We were previously in Marion. Okay. Um, and yeah, like you said, we're more than just cakes, actually. Mm -hmm. um, whenever you walk into the bakery, we offer cinnamon rolls. We mm -hmm. offer cookie dough brownies and sugar cookies. Um, but then one thing that we specialize in are our cakes like I have on display today. Right. Um, these are just a few of the popular trends. These are not just cakes. These are works of art. I mean, do people really even want to cut these after you prepare them? One, when we show people our cakes, they sometimes they are shocked at how good they actually look. And yeah. then um, the best part about it is they taste as they good taste. as they look good. <sighs> That's yes. something that we take pride in is that all of our product seriously tastes as good as it looks. Okay. You know, with all the new health, you know, things people are going through and regimens, what about gluten? Can they get gluten free? Stuff yeah. Um, fat free. So we don't do fat free or yet. sugar free, um, but whatever, whatever you like to talk yourself into. Okay. Okay. Um, I tell people that all the time. I'll take the calories out for you guys. Thank you. Um, Gosh, but if you so are nice. looking for something like gluten free, we do offer it. You just have to call the bakery because um, we don't have it ready to go. So okay. just give us a call and um, we do offer gluten free. It's a special order. Well, let's talk about some of these techniques because I know today you're going to do what's called, uh, it's trending now. What is it? Messy frosting? Well, yeah, or? we're just going to... Um, Messy Isis cake. Messy, I'm going to okay. show you guys how to maybe do um, a cake at home. If you uh, are into the DIY type thing or you sure. want to design a cake um, at home, it's super easy. You can use anything from fresh flowers. We've got fruits. Um, you can even go to the uh, Hobby Lobby or the store sure. and get some cake toppers and put on it. Absolutely. First of all, first of all, every time I bake a cake at home, all and of that it never don't happens. come out. That never happens. How do you get yeah. it all out? It wants to look yeah. like this. So actually, this is just the um, kind of pan that we use. You'll see whenever I flip this over, it's just that all fall. comes it's out too. It's just gonna fall right That's out. Good. It just yeah. looks beautiful. Every once in a while, we have some accidents, but we I have, have one every time. Happy accident. accidents. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All, all right. right. Tell me about these. What are these techniques? What is that technique? Okay. Called? So this is the latest style. This is called a geode cake. Um, you probably have all seen it on Pinterest or on Google. There was a big thing on. Uh, the TV about it, but those are the geode cakes, and you can do those in any colors, um, any design that's really popular over here. What's it supposed to represent? And all edible, right? It, this is all edible, yeah. This is just rock candy um, that we've designed. It's like and you we just actually made a discovery in your cake. Yeah, we actually had to carve the cake out to get to get the um, shape of it, and then we formed rock candy. So it's supposed to look like the inside of a rock. There that, it is. That's awesome. Yeah. So cool. It is really cool. And then over here, the smaller cake, we have a marble, mm. the marble effect that's been really popular. Of course, yeah. the gold glitter. We're putting gold on every wedding cake yes. this year, uh -huh. it seems like. This is a gift. You know, think about it. People used to show up with flowers and stuff. Imagine now going, here you go. Here is a cake. It is a gift. It, yes. it looks awesome. It's something, it's great. It's something that you can't really get around here except at Atlee's. That's right. I would love that for Mother's Day. I would that's love that. Beautiful. Yes, I would love it for Christmas. I would love it for Valentine's Day. <laughs> on what Fridays, other, uh, on Fridays, Friday. uh, maybe Mondays. You can Mondays. do anything with those kinds of cakes. We, you can take all that off and put flowers on it. So pretty. It, it is very gorgeous. And is this all edible? For summer, it is. The fruit for the summer is it's delicious. It's it's very eye catching. All right, so let's talk about right. what you're gonna do and uh, and and show us just how easy. Okay. How easy. Okay. It is. So right. it really is easy. I'm gonna show you guys how you can um, ice a cake at home. So if you're as lucky as me, it comes out this nice uh -huh. um, with your pan. So I lucky. just have some of our, um, this is our signature buttercream frosting. This is yes. what makes our cakes um, yes, please. different. And this makes our cakes different. We don't, um, all of our frosting is handmade. We slave over the frosting. We take you pride in it. You won't give the recipe, will you? I'm, not, I'm not going to. Okay. However you guys make your frosting at home is going to be perfectly fine. You can use it. Uh, so and then first, you'll want to go buy a cake by Allie yeah. when you're done. Yeah. Hey, wait. <laughs> and then when I do ice it, Part of the cake gets up in the frosting. What, why, what am I doing wrong? Babe. Okay, so that, okay, so that's step one to icing a cake, but I'm gonna totally override that part because this is a DIY cake, so I'm gonna totally skip that. Okay. But whenever you're icing a cake at home, we, or at the bakery, we have what you call dirty icing. So okay. you do a smooth layer over it, kind of uh, like that, and then you put it in the refrigerator and you uh, let it set up, so that way it's it's That's uh, it, solid. Gotta let it set up. And it's hard, and then you can frost it and you're not gonna have any crumbs or any mess. Okay. And did you notice, like, she's got this much icing, you know? I mean, I thought, I, that, 
that, that much. And I'm so happy because I'm that girl. It's like, you're going to eat your icing? <laughs> you know how people are like putting on the side? I, I, I like, like the, the corner icing too. Mm -hmm. yeah. I want the corner. I love that. Okay, so right now I'm just working on icing this cake. I'm going to start from uh, the top and then okay. I'm going to work my way down. Okay. But it's going to be a textured icing anyway, so I'm not worried about making it smooth. Okay. I'm just worried about making it even. Take Brilliant. us back real quick, Allie, and, and what was your interest in cakes? How old were you? What? Tell oh us Oh my story. gosh. Um, I started getting into cakes whenever I was only 16. Oh. I was still in high school. I was watching all the popular shows like The Cake Boss, mm -hmm. um, you know, Gigi's Cupcakes, all that. I was into it. And so I just started icing cakes at home. Um, and then whenever I was 18, I actually opened up my first bakery in Marion. That's awesome. Um, and then we moved over Entrepreneur. to Entrepreneur. So. Yeah, awesome. I am. And that's really, I love what I do. So it makes it easy. Um, a lot of hard work and a lot of time, but it makes it easy because I like it. I like to make people happy. I like um, to bake and create things. And really for me, it is like you call it, it's about the artwork. Sure. Um, Absolutely. And producing something that tastes as good as it looks. It's not cardboard cake. It's mm -hmm. not frosting so hard. I told you the story, didn't I, about my wedding cake? No. Okay. You know how, do they still, this might be an old fashioned thing. Do you still take the top piece and put it in the refrigerator? Oh, freezer? I think people do that. People sure. still do it. Sure. Okay. Whenever well, they didn't tell me the top piece was styrofoam. <laughs> I kept that piece in my freezer <laughs> for a year. Oh, oh honey. I got the little wine glasses. Are you ready? Uh, er, 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 are you <laughs> kidding? No, I'm not. Somebody should have told you. They that was just it. cruel. That's cruel. That's very, that's cruel. <laughs> and so when you go wine. get your wedding cake at a bakery, uh -huh. say, is my top piece edible? But yours are, right? <laughs> Unless otherwise specified, all of our uh, cakes are edible. <laughs> I don't know where you got yours. At the dollar yours store. Had the, it had the bridge. <laughs> did it have the bridge and the, uh, did it the have little the little bridge? It did, it did. The tear right. separators. Yes. It did. Yeah. Yes, okay. the columns. So I've got this whole cake covered. What I'm going to do is I can show you a couple different things. I'm just going to take this and run it just in circles. This is called a messy icing because mm -hmm. that looks very, very neat to me. Just watch, no. Okay. You know what? If you wanted a messy look, you should have let us. Oh know. man, that we would have just worn it. Up. All I'm doing is running my spatula across the side. Look at that. That's and cute. That is brilliant. I don't call that messy. Not at all. Well, good. Okay. So whatever you decide that you want to decorate with at home, whether it be flowers or fruits, mm -hmm. um, or a cake topper right here on top, and then of course a cake stand that you. Um, do so all I'm gonna do is just put some fruit on here and this would be good for like a summer party or something gorgeous or even uh, a baby smash cake all right um, can we move to the cupcakes real quick yeah What's the flavors I know you're you're big on flavors we are so we do offer a one? variety of gourmet flavors and these change every uh, month at the bakery so one way to keep up with the weather changing is on our Facebook page can we um, try oh yeah of course these are not styrofoam those are not styrofoam oh, nice. this is our Oreo explosion cake uh, Ex cupcake excuse me I'm ready to have an Oreo explosion and right there is our lemon so that is seasonal for spring and summer it Very will only nice. be around until uh, the end of summer. What's this one? This is cookie dough, and that <gasps> one has a cookie dough filling in it. <sighs> I'm gonna start there. Are they all different? Or oh, that's the same thing. Those are the same flavors, but I've got some bridal white. I've got red velvet, and then there's Italian cream over there as well. And then we offer um, other things like strawberry, chocolate cheesecake, turtle cheesecake. Mm. Mm. Look it at it. It is so good. So good. Yeah. I think you got a career here. Mm. Yeah, I think sometimes Amazing. sometimes I'm like, I'm really good at this. I've got a good thing going. And then something bad happens, and I'm like, I'm not a professional. No. no. Um, yes, you are. No, you <laughs> are. Yes, you are. And, and we know that you strive to make your customers happy. You go above and beyond. And if you we have tried not her. tried her, you must. Uh, they can find you online. Yeah, we're online on Facebook. Um, just search Cakes by Alley. Okay. Make sure it's the hair and location. Um, okay. Or we're on Snapchat. We're on Instagram. You, you are. You can send us an email. You can give us a call even um, if you want to if you decide you want to place an order. Yeah. Uh, the only thing that you have to pre-order are a cake. If you want a specialty cake or a birthday cake. Other than that, you can stop into the bakery and get sugar cookies. You can get cinnamon rolls for the weekend. Mm. Yeah. Cookie dough That's brownies. Awesome. I tried one time. Mm. I, I said, hey, I need a cake last minute. She goes, hey, call me like two weeks ago. <laughs> <laughs> okay. For, the, for our specialty cakes, I'm glad you said that. For our specialty cakes, we do like about a week in advance. Yeah. Sure. For just a regular birthday cake, you just need something to take um, or just for family, just about 24 hours. But it'll be oh, worth it. Yes. Absolutely. So good. Thank yeah. you very much. Thank you. You're welcome. And we'll be fun. right back. 
coming up on the spiel. Is there a certain force by which you hit the, the can or what? I mean, yeah, we definitely have dynamics and like you'll see for, uh, from the music that we have range of heights that we hit the, the drums at and of course they make a different sound, a different timbre for the height that you hit it. If you live in Southern Illinois, you drive around, you're probably going to go buy one of our buildings or know somebody that has a building that we have put up. It's only limited by one's imagination. You can build pretty much anything with post frame building. They're economical and sturdy. It's going to last a long time. We try to work hard, get the job done buy efficiently to keep the cost as, as low as possible for our customer. We have a website, newcomconstruction.com. At the end of the day, I, I have to be satisfied with the work we do. You'll know you're in Shawnee forest country when the hills rise up to meet you. The Shawnee National Forest is home to miles of unbelievable natural wonders. Plan your getaway at southernmostillinois.com. My name is Dr. Claravel Baricuatro Christi. I am a board certified pediatrician. I have three children, 17, 13, and three. I would never try to give anything to your child that I would not give to my own child. That's the guiding principle of my practice. And I think it has served my children and my patients very well throughout the years. For those of you who are thinking of finding great pediatric care in the area, look no further than in your own backyard because we're here. Three Rivers provides a lot of support, a great sense of culture and community at Three Rivers College. What better choice? You know, the smaller classes allow you to participate and that is the biggest thing that I think Three Rivers had to offer me was I have the experience of actually doing it, not reading it in a textbook and what it's about. I chose elementary education. Three Rivers has it mapped out. They have what you need to take, what credits are going to transfer. It was clear expectations from the very beginning. My name is Cody Young and I graduated from Three Rivers College in 2009. I then moved on to Hannibal LaGrange on Three Rivers campus and graduated in 2012 with a bachelor's degree in education. I was hired at Popper Bluff that year in 2012 and I am still currently teaching. Since then I have obtained a master's degree in administration education, uh, grades K through 8. You know, my enjoyment is hands-on, minds-on learning and you know, you see that light bulb click and the smile on their faces. I'm completely happy right here where I'm at right now. We love making new friends. Visit us online at facebook.com forward slash spiel on. The Spiel presents You're On, 100% original new music. All right, we're the Marion High School drum line, and uh, today we're going to be performing the uh, Trash Can Jam.
collection is a huge part in any place you go. People don't want to drive and see one of this or two of that. At Tri-State, we have over 300 in stock. Travel trailers starting at $11,995. Fifth wheels starting at $24,995. And toy haulers at $12,995. We have people coming from Mississippi, from Pennsylvania, Colorado. We put a camper in almost every state now. They shop online, they shop on the telephone. Come see us, check us out online at tristaterv.com. I think we'll surprise you. I won't be beat. The biggest thing in life is to help other people. So I feel like every day I go to work, if I can make a difference, either it's small or large, it's worth it. Three Rivers has a program for Firefighter 1 and 2. Um, after you do that, you're going to go through and you're going to take a state test that qualifies you to be an actual professional firefighter. And Three Rivers is just a great place to start. A great program. The campus is really easy to get around. Um, I'm actually an adjunct instructor, so I further to go on and do that. So I really enjoy seeing someone that started where I started at. Not every day you make an impact, but when someone's at their worst, it makes you feel great that you can step in there and help somebody in the time of need. Three Rivers College. Success starts here. I'm Krista Pesca. I have joined Christopher Rural Health. I was born and raised here in Southern Illinois on a farm, and I've been here practicing now for approximately 16 years, and I see people of all ages. My main approach is I just treat people like family. I mean, I would treat them just like I would treat my mother or father. At CRHPC Community Health Centers, we strive to give excellent care to patients in all the communities we serve. Let us be your medical home. The Shawnee National Forest is home to miles of unbelievable natural wonders. Plan your getaway at southernmostillinois.com. You're watching The Spiel. The Marion High School drum line. Wow, you guys take a bow. Everybody, you're good. You you're guys like, are really, really, like, you can really curtsy, good. You can bow, you can do whatever. You could like twirl a stick. It Was that amazing? That was amazing. I, you know what, is there someone, I know you have a, a teacher and a coach, yes. uh, instructor. Is there somebody kind of in charge, kind of too? Is it this guy here in the middle? No. Who is no, it? It's Mitchell Rushing. Mitchell Rushing. Mitchell Rushing. Where is he? Where is he? Oh, uh, he's not here. Yeah, he's Mitchell at work. Yeah. Not here. He's, he's at college. He's instructor. a college right now. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We did need your professor to point out that you can't afford drums. I mean, you oh. can, you just yeah. choose you this, right? Yeah. Because That's right. it's a good sound. Okay. Um, what is it that you're trying to accomplish when you guys are arranging songs, when you're practicing? You want it to look cool, but you also want it to have a beat where people want to dance. What are you, what are you trying to achieve? Well, when we play at um, half times of football games, it's really to get the crowd going up. So we put, we put shows together that um, we can get the crowd into, and with the visuals, we want a good balance between visuals um, to like, showcase everything that we're doing. Okay. That incorporates it into the music. It just makes it pop, so it's a lot of fun. It it definitely, pop. you can't be a marching drum line, because you can't carry these, right? No, you can roll it. Huh? Yeah. No, no, it is. Yeah. So, you know, I have to wonder, you obviously want to play loud, but my goodness, some of these things, I don't know if yeah. you've seen the shape of these tops. I mean, they're bent in, and is there a certain force by which you hit the, the can, or what? I mean, yeah, we definitely have dynamics, and like you'll see for, uh, from the music that we have range of heights that we hit the, the drums at, and of course they make a different sound, a different timbre for the height that you hit it. Okay. And so at the end, you'll see us kind of drop down, then we come back up and build up for a powerful ending. I love that. I and then you, you're sharing sticks, you're like not hitting one another, but it's getting close. I mean, mm -hmm. there's just a lot to watch, right? Are, are you all in the band too, like the marching band too? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay. Do you play, anybody play drums in the marching band, all of you? This is the drum line. Yeah. This well, is the drum line yeah, yeah. right here. Look at that. <laughs> versatile I mean they right. can play whatever wow. mom at home is like do you know how many things they've played in my house like they've tried the, the <laughs> Tupperware pots, bowls the, pans, the Tupperware mm -hmm. absolutely okay well Julie and I we would love to show our audience by doing okay so we're obviously gonna want to try can Does, I just say something real quick what um, the reason I ask about which one drums in the band because I'm from ZR and we only had one drummer so this just blows my Ziegler mind. Ziegler <laughs> Royalton that's why I mean the one the one even with the merged schools you had the, or the merged towns we you had the one merged back in my day oh okay oh. all right all right um, so if we wanted to learn a little ditty 
a little beat? Would it make sense to do it with the lids, with these, with this? What do you think we can, uh, I mean, the igloo is probably out. That looks pretty complex. It does. I don't know about that. So what do you think we should do? How about you guys split up? We're gonna split. Yeah, one plays the trash can, one All plays All right, this. we're gonna, here, I'm gonna let you hold the mic. Okay, here. we need some instructions, so tell me what we're gonna do. This side. Oh. May I have your attention, please? <laughs> That's how it'll begin. All right, here we go. Okay, okay. okay. All right, so you're just going to keep a pretty steady tempo here. You're just gonna... Can you do that? Give, give that a try. Give it a try. So, just... I'm not left-handed. That's okay. That's okay. Switch it up then. Keep it steady because I'm going to kick in. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Good. Yeah. <laughs> can you, can you no, you can't either, apparently. Apparently not. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, guys. You were Thank great. You so that was much. awesome. So much fun to watch. And uh, they're going to be stars now. We'll share this video and yes. they'll go viral and it'll be great. Yeah. Okay. All mm -hmm. right. Thanks so much. Play us out, guys. Thank you. All right. At the Bank of Heron, we know that between family and work, it can be a challenge to find the time to take care of things like going to the bank. And really, what you need is a way to do your banking on the go. Well, we've got good news. With the Bank of Heron mobile banking app, you can manage debit cards, find bank locations, monitor account activity, even make a deposit. Just a few of the ways our mobile banking app can save you a trip to the bank. We'd love for you to come see us, but now you don't have to. The Bank of Heron. It's not just a bank, it's mobile banking. Hey, Chef Rob here, introducing our new Chef Splendor Dips from Prairie Farms. They come in spicy ranch, roasted red pepper, and my favorite, tzatziki. Made with 100% real sour cream, we're crafted in small batches, all natural ingredients, no artificial growth hormones added, and gluten-free. Look for us today. Check out our website at prairiefarms.com. When you lose your teeth, you lose not just the ability to chew and eat and smile, which is a big thing, but you lose a part of yourself. It was life-changing when I came into Dr. Hughes. It showed me videos and models, and these are the choices we had. These were the options. Training matters. Experience matters. And the thing which is extremely important is compassion. It brings back your ability to chew, You're restoring a sense of dignity. Come in and see Dr. Hughes. The greatest thing I ever did for myself. Our business is printed apparel, embroidery, signage, cups and mugs and so forth. We are not just about the sale, we're about building a relationship with our customers. We have the latest technology, we have craftsmen here, we have people that really have a passion for what we're doing. The whole buying process can really be enjoyable, quality and transparency and integrity. Awesome customer service. We tend to respond to what our customers' needs are. We've been in business for 36 years, we want to make sure that we're taking care of the customer. We price online. Most dealers won't do that. I won't be beat. They get a hold of us, want to look at a camper, we give them a video, we give them a write-up. They don't have to be in our showroom to do their homework, but we are 100% a full-service deal. The parts, we've got a service van from the customer service department. People are buying these, they're happy. They're going somewhere with the kids, with their grandparents, with their parents. Get a hold of us, tell us what you want to look at, and see what you get from us. It will surprise you. Tri-State RV. We supply the how, you supply the happy. You're watching The Spiel. That was a good show. What'd we learn? We learned uh, no matter what our size, no matter how wrinkles we have, no matter what. What? 
Be yourself, be happy about yourself, be confident. Live every yes. day, baby. I mean, live it and live it to the fullest. Because you never know. You never know. And, and we also encourage you to eat cake. What did Allie say? Just eat cake. Just eat, eat it. Cake. Eat, eat cake. Yeah, you two on a diet, eat cake. Yeah, now popcorn, whole other story. You know what? I'm going to tell a story. I went to a concert a couple weeks ago. Seventh row back, Seventh sitting row. in the middle. It's quiet. It was, it was quiet. It was a, a serious Christian. topic. Serious, yeah. And they were reading a little. Reading about, something yeah, serious. Verse, Very yeah. serious, yes. I'm eating popcorn <laughs> like this. My daughter says I was doing this. Oh, yeah. I'm kind of thinking that no. was probably the motion. No, I was doing this. Look, I don't think we're a one kernel gal. I mean, neither one of us. Well, I just ate and I was really full. Okay, That's so you're I was picking. doing you're one picking. at a time. I really didn't okay. want it. Well, you I, learned a lesson. You'll never do that again. Well, no, yeah. I'll put you do handfuls. Right. right, right there. So anyway, I'm doing this, and all of a sudden, a kernel here it comes stuck in the windpipe. Wow, there's nothing. It's a, it, it must have been a big, big kernel. Like a, it was popped. It was probably popped. And there's it got, nothing it, it, going in or out. Oh my gosh. I mean, and your daughter does not want you to bother her currently. She's, she's sitting busy. beside me. And she's I said, listening. She's like, Mom, not now, right? And, yeah. Okay. So I couldn't wait any longer. I knew I had to, I had to get help. So I. You know, usually at the movies, you excuse me, Gingerly, excuse me. Yeah, no, not me. I was stepping on people, and I was getting and, and by, you, and you couldn't anyway. breathe. You were like, oh, "There's nothing." You couldn't even. You couldn't go in. You couldn't go out. There's no okay. noise. People there's been no there. nothing. People have. People understand what you're talking about. Oh right my now. gosh! I got to the the little hallway. Yeah. No one's in the hallway. I'm. I'm. It's this black. is where it's going to end for her. And I thought it was. That's and not... then I got. I went to the rail to hang on, and I was. You were going down. There was nothing. Oh my gosh. Lady named Katina came by. Katina, thank you, Katina. That's that's that was big of you. Thank started you. Started beating the heck out of my back she and screaming did. for help because I. Were, were you like blue at this color or yeah, at this point? That, you think you lost your color? I was gone. I was gone. I was gone. Scary. Two guys from the civic center came out and they started working on my back a little bit. Working you know? on you. And, yeah. And it came out. They did thank the whole Jesus. Whoop, like that and just it just shot out. So you know wow. what? that tells you you never know number one when your time is okay. Correct, could be and, any time. Um, learn CPR. Learn the Heimlich. Learn the, he the Heimlich or the Heimlich. <laughs> the Heimlich. The Heimlich. The Heimlich maneuver. Yeah, the, you know, <laughs> like that. The, you know the, the, what? I know Heimlich. it's Heimlich, but at our house we say Heimlich. I know. That's that's bad. That's not the procedure. That we're is really try to bad. Learn. Don't learn yeah, that don't procedure. Learn that one. <laughs> Did you think about me? Was I like one of the last things to go through your mind? Like, ah, who's going to host with Angie now? No. You, no the last I, thing I, I the last thing I was thinking of was, I'm going to kill my daughter <laughs> because I would like to see her face before I go out of this world. Yeah, and she wasn't interested. She nah. Yeah. Yeah. So then I walked back in to, after I got myself together. I walked back into the concert and I go, it's good. I'm good. <laughs> it's all good. Those and who again, were wondering. Very somber occasion, you know, not the kind of place you want to be really loud, but this one makes the announcement that she's good. But it's anyway, all good. it just. Did you save the colonel? Did you, did you save no. the. Yeah. Like put it in formaldehyde on the show. <laughs> That's right. That right there almost yeah. took me out. That's Sorry, right. Yeah. The year was 18. <laughs> you know what? That would have been awful, because my daughter would have put that in my obituary. That you were killed by popcorn? Killed by popcorn. That'd be awful. She'd that do it, though. Be terrible. She would do it. But anyway, just be, she, be very be careful, careful out there. Eat, don't eat kernels. I, I didn't know. know a kernel was in that piece of popcorn. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. what it is. It's a pop. It's a kernel. But it's it a pops. Kernel. They, yeah, but the little husk thing, you're still in there. you got to have some. I must have pop. a little windpipe, because the little husk thing just <laughs> landed perfect. Perfect. <laughs> All right, we need a word. We haven't done any preparation. We have a word. Yeah. Let's uh, see. Resuscitation. Like, resuscitation. That's a good one, but I, I think people know that. You'd be they know the resuscitation. Julie they know the didn't Heimlich know the difference maneuver. between Heimlich and Heimlich. I'm so, so we'll sorry. Do. I'm, resuscitation. I'm just sorry. Um, resuscitation. Um, What's another word? Great that, word for like longevity, to live life to the fullest, to. Think of a word. Um, um, we really need sorry. something. Carpe diem or soup de jour? <laughs> Popcorn ole. Popcorn ole. I mean, any Carpe of those. Carpe diem. Work. That's Carpe good. diem. What's that? Seize the day. Yes, that's right. Seize the day. Let's do it. Let's do it. How many syllables is that? Carpe diem. Four. Is that? I don't think it's one word. Is We're going to make it? it. It's two. Carpe diem. Okay. Two words? Yes. First word? 
Remember that? How many syllables? Did you? Sorry. Did that fish, sound fish, like? fish, carp. <laughs> All right, you're leading? Yeah. Okay. Car. Pay. D. Um, I don't think it's, is it four syllables? Carpe diem? Thank you very that much. That was great. Da, 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 da. No, let's do it one more time because you stopped for a while. Did you see even. like how it spilled out of our mouths last week? This is like the electric company. I don't know if you guys remember that. What? Do I have a necklace in my mind? Okay, I have to pull my shirt down. You know what? It's just getting worse, folks. Okay. I need my gloves if I'm going to pull my shirt down. Carpa, carpe, carpe diem. Carpe diem. Okay. Carpa. Did you see where it came? This was like the electric company back in the day, you know, with the mouths, they do this, and then we learn Syllables. the word. That's what we do here. At the we show. teach them we, a word every week. We teach people week. every week. I'm pretty sure no one has ever used any of the words that we've suggested. Because I've never used them since. No, not after we leave the set, definitely. Carpe diem, what is it? Okay, the definition is a good one. Is it carpe or one. carpe? Used to urge someone to make the most of the present time and give little thought to the future. That is perfect. The healthy hippie chef, that's why we keep her around, right there. You just earned that. That was excellent. And she's Make so the cute. most of the present day. And Carpe she can diem. We don't even worry about the future. Like nobody. All right. She's good? Okay. Oh Car. Pay. D. Um, yeah. You, why did you try to get the last one there? Because <laughs> you do me that that's way. That's all right. We know what the definition is. We'll see you right back here next week. Feel was super fun. I love coming and uh, talking with Julie and Angie, and it's uh, always a great experience to come and showcase what I have to offer. Yay! Is that him? It's awesome. say what's going on thank you for following every single behind the scenes we have ever posted Yay! We, we're crazy about these videos we're crazy about hanging out we're crazy about you 
right. and bringing you content that you actually enjoy. So keep following us, keep being a part of what we're doing, keep checking in on the Facebook, keep checking in on the Twitter, whatever it is, just keep following and we can't wait to keep sharing with you guys the cool stuff. We got stuff going on, so I'll get back to you. Education is important. Three Rivers makes it easy to get one. With locations in Dexter, Kennett, Malden, Piedmont, Sykeston, Cape, and Poplar Bluff. With over 100 programs of study in high demand areas like criminal justice, diesel mechanics, nursing, business, teacher education, even ag technology. Three Rivers College has a degree for you and a convenient location where you can get it. So what are you waiting for? The time to enroll is right now. Don't miss your mark. Success starts here. Three Rivers College. Hi, I'm Woody, the Southside Lumber Customer Service Emoji. Did you know that Southside has been family owned and operated since 1946? We have over 75,000 square feet of the best names in paint, hardware, lumber, tools, and anything else you might need for your home. That's why we are the choice local supplier for contractors and homeowners alike. <laughs> With more than 70 years in the industry, Southside Lumber can help you say, nailed it. At the Bank of Heron, we know that between family and work, it can be a challenge to find the time to take care of things like going to the bank. And really, what you need is a way to do your banking on the go. Well, we've got good news. With the Bank of Heron mobile banking app, you can manage debit cards, find bank locations, monitor account activity, even make a deposit. Just a few of the ways our mobile banking app can save you a trip to the bank. We'd love for you to come see us, but now you don't have to. The Bank of Heron. It's not just a bank, it's mobile banking. Health Healthcare is very complicated and complex, and lower-income folks, um, they, don't, they don't have the access that everyone should have, which is primary care. There are a lot of different pay scales that are part of the system through CRHPC. Healthcare is affordable to everyone, no matter whether they have insurance or not. We will find a place and, and a way to take care of you. No one will be turned away. Everyone will be seen and we'll work with them to find the best route for them to, to get the care they need. Find us on CRHPC.org. These days, video is everywhere. TVs, computers, even your phone. With so many ways to use video to reach your potential audience, it's become an important part of doing business. If you like the commercials you've seen during the spiel, and if your business could benefit from a creative approach to telling your story, with attention-grabbing visuals and thoughtfully executed scripts, perhaps it's time you give Growing Media a call. We'd love to hear from you. 